check this out. Today I'm going to be living as my brother Carter Share for 24 hours. What does living as my brother for the day entail? A bunch of crazy things. Driving monster trucks, crushing cars, wheeling on dirt bikes, backflips, eating crazy snacks, a bunch of wild things. And I do know that means I'm gonna have to drive this snowmobile across the lake. How's that gonna go? I don't know, but make sure to watch till the end of this video because I'll be giving away one free VIP meet and greet tickets to my live shows this summer if I can successfully make it across the lake on this snowmobile. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. So let's get this vlog started. Let's go. I don't know why people say me and my brother look alike. Yeah, we don't look anything alike. Do, do we? we? Do we look like twins? I mean, we are wearing the same color hoodie. Maybe that's why, Steve. You know what? We shouldn't have worn the same clothes today. Well, you know, let's just get the day started. Apparently you do a lot in a day. Steven, if you're gonna be Carter for the next 24 hours, we gotta get started with my first daily activity. What is that? And cheers, I know that at some point in this video, my brother's gonna get hungry and he's gonna want a snack. And that's why I have this entire section of snacks lined up because while he's snacking, my sister Grace Share and I planted the perfect prank on my brother and he has no idea. Yeah, the saran wrap prank is gonna be so good. And while you and Carter are outside doing challenges, he's gonna think I'm on my laptop, but I'm really gonna set up the prank. Whoa, whoa. Activity one, Steve, I come down here to the trampoline park and I start the morning with a backflip. A backflip every day? Yeah, when was the last time you did a backflip? Uh, I think I can actually do this one. I'm good at backflips on the trampoline now. So I normally come out, I bounce around, get a few warm up bounces like this, and then I backflip. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, my hair is kind of the same without it. Oh yeah. Maybe I don't need that after all. Okay, well that was my backflip and now it's your turn. My turn, let's do this. And don't let your wig fall off like mine. Because <laughs> you have to be me for 24 hours. And without that, his blonde hair is going to be showing. Okay, backflip, easy. Just get a couple bounces in three, two. Wait, Steve, don't mess up! You just want to make sure that you're going to be good. Three, two, one. Woo! And the wig stayed on. Okay, well, activity one is great. So you want to know what I do next? Make it harder and harder. It gets more Carter share y as the day goes on. Let's just put it that way. Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay, what's the next activity? Let's go. Steven is currently filming a video with Carter, but Steven texted me to set up a prank. There's saran wrap. This will actually be perfect. Saran wrap, surprisingly, goes a long way for pranks. Whoa! Whoa! Next up, we got the dirt bike, because here at the team our house, we're on a hundred acres, and so riding dirt bikes is almost a must to get around. And it's so fun riding on two wheels, so I've been practicing my dirt bike wheelie, which reminds me of some OG video where I remember teaching you how to dirt bike wheelie. Pop it! Whoa! Whoa! That was awesome! And it's still very hard. Yeah, so we'll see if Steven still has it from like eight years ago, that vlog. So we're gonna try it again, and we're gonna try practicing our wheelies. Oops, that's embarrassing. Oh my gosh. He was the last one to drive this. There we go. All right, so I'm in first gear. I'm gonna go up the hill. I'm gonna let the clutch out, and then I'm gonna pull back and give it gas to wheelie. Okay, so you're gonna roll like this, and then you lean back. Oh! Ah! <laughs> okay, that was a bad wheelie. Let me try again. Straight. That was better, I think. Oh! Oh! Okay, those were like, okay, but anyways, I wanna see how good you are. Okay, I'll try it. Last time I did wheelies, I was on one-way little man's bicycle and I had troubles doing them. Oh, there we go, a little bit longer. Bring it up more like this. But you had to pedal on that. This I can at least use gas. Right, here we go, guys. Steven doesn't drive dirt bikes nearly as much as me, so I think he's gonna be nervous. He's already doing it wrong. That's so embarrassing. <laughs> Steven, you're like fake. He's fake pulling. He's not coming up the hill. He didn't listen to anything I said. Steven, you have to start there and come up this way. I don't wanna go up a hill. Oh, he actually did it. He did it. <laughs> here we go, that's not bad. Okay, he actually got the wheel off the ground, like two inches. I think the hill's throwing me off. I think flat ground's bad. Well, it wheelies and you pull it down, which is really annoying. Oh. <laughs> he goes up to do a wheelie, but instead of leaning back, he fights it and pushes it back down. Okay, ready? Come on, Steve. I did it, I did it, I did it. Okay, that was actually good. I won't talk any more smack on Steven, I mean Carter. Carter 2.0. All 
I think that counts. That does count. I was talking so much smack on you earlier, but that time you actually embraced the wheelie and you came off like uh, about a foot, so. It counts? I think that counts. All right, moving on to the next activity. All right, let's go. Tag on, Carter. Smaller hill's easier. Tag on. Oh! oh! Almost <laughs> fell off the back. So, let me stage this. Perfect. So we got the saran wrap. Next step is to get tape. It can be any tape. Scotch tape is probably best because it's clear. Babe, uh, I mean Carter, if you're really gonna be me for the day, you have to be brave. We're riding a dirt bike together. <laughs> All right, going across the bridge. Yeah, we've fallen. We're falling in the water. Okay, grab the, grab this. Uh, we're gonna crash. Okay. No, Carter, that's a hill. I can only hit front brake. All right, we're almost there. We're, we're almost halfway. Hey, Carter. What's up, Carter? Have you heard Steven's new song? Oh, my brother Steven's new song? No, I haven't heard it. What is it? All right, this is a song. This is an unreleased song called We Are Who We Are. If you guys think Steven should drop it, comment it down below. Oh, yeah. Because we are who we are. Share the love. And if you want to see Steven perform this live in concert, make sure to get tickets to his live show right now at stevensherrod.com. All right, and we are almost here. What is this stuff? What are we doing here? So this looks like a huge mess, and it is. If you guys watch my second vlog channel, Carter's Life, you guys know I've been working pretty heavily on this project. So today, I got to do a little bit more work. So we got to go over to that machine, and we got to drive and move some dirt. You ready, Carter? Uh, yeah. So Steve, have you actually ever driven one of these before? I have not. Well, it's called a skid steer. It moves dirt. And uh, yeah, so just climb up in there. We're gonna turn it on. And well, you are Carter, you are me. I know how to drive one of these, which means you need to know how to drive one of these. So I think we just put them in, turn the key, and just see if you can go pick up some dirt. And oh, the seat is squishy. Yeah, the seat's great. <laughs> what? This is cool. It's like a roller coaster. Safety first, you're gonna buckle up. Cool. Hold the armrest down like a roller coaster. I'm not gonna tell you too much, but good luck, Steve. I mean, Carter. Good luck, Carter. Okay, so there is a ton of switches in here. This is insane. Uh, joystick here, joystick here. Oh my gosh, guys, he's gonna mess something up. This thing isn't the easiest thing to drive in the world, but um, look, if he's gonna be Carter for the day, he's gonna have to just figure it out. This is, you know, it's a challenge after all to pretend to be somebody else. Pedal here, or what is that? I think that's a pedal, but I do see keys here, so I'm just gonna assume that this is how you start it. Yeah, that did something. Oh, there's a TV screen. And there's air conditioning. Oh, this is nice. Waiting. Any day now, start it up and get, get to work. We, you know, the time's ticking. We're burning sunlight. We gotta get some dirt move. We gotta finish this pond project. Oh, he figured it out. Okay, I figured out how to turn it on. Oh, this is cool, look at this. I literally have never driven one of these before. Comment down below if you think Steven is playing a good representation of me. Oh, he's got it. Wait, lift the bucket first. Woo! <laughs> okay, I guess I gotta go slower with this thing. There we go. Yes! That's good. He's got the curl going. He's got the lift. Let's see if he can drive. Yes! Oh, this is so cool. No way. This is what Carter does every day. This is so cool. And he's driving. This is like Bob the Builder in real life. So now he's gonna try to get some dirt because this thing, that's what it's meant for. It's meant to scoop dirt, spread it, and move it. So he's working at trying to pick up this pile of dirt into the bucket. It's basically like a big shovel. So let's see if he can do it. Make this go higher. There we go. He got some dirt in there. That is so cool. I'm literally like driving a video game. Okay, I can see why Carter likes to do this activity every single day. And it's not that hard. I really figured it out already. Here we go. Steven's first ever load of dirt. Look how small it is. Oh, that's so funny. Oh, okay, but he's doing good. Hey, it's free work. He's, you know, he's driving the machine, so. Whew, that was fun. Okay, not bad. I just uh, helped you with your palm project. That was pretty good. It's not the easiest thing in the world to drive one of these, but I would say challenge complete. And I think we're ready for the next activity. I'm able to do anything. Let's do this. So now we have the blue tape here that will go on one door. And then we'll move it all the way across. You can't see it because it's clear. And then Carter will walk through and get trapped. Whoa, whoa. We're going from the front pond and now we're on to the garages for the next challenge. Hang on, Steve. Everyone smash the like button. I'm doing so good at being my brother's twin for the day. Let's go, whoa. twin Carter. Yeah. And into 
to the garage, we all go. That's so embarrassing. No, come on, keep going. So this is the car garage, Carter, Steven. I don't even know what to refer to you. But just like every morning when you get dressed and you put on a new pair of pants, shoes, or a hoodie, um, depending on the day, well, I come in here and I pick a different car, depending on the mood, depending on the weather. For example, we got the dune buggy. This is great if it's a nice sunny summer day like today. So this could be a great choice. Sweet, yeah, that's, that sounds good. If you're feeling a little bit more Wolf of Wall Street old school, you might go with the Lamborghini Countach, but you know. I've never driven this. We could drive this today. That's great. Yeah, it's a we great could. Day. Or we could go onto the world's smallest mini Hummer that's actually street legal, AKA the Humbug. I would like to drive this. I love this thing. It's kind of like a Jeep top down. Or we could have the real thing, which is the Hummer. Yeah, let's take this. We have more options. We gotta check them all out. Or we could go boating on land. I've never driven this. This is cool, but I'd rather not drive this thing. But if this isn't your taste, then why not hit something a little bit more luxurious? We have the Team Roy limo. Oh, I just did a road trip in it for seven hours. I don't need to drive that. Or we could go Japanese with the little joy pop. That's cool. Or we could go a little bit more uh, exotic, like the Ferrari, the world's cheapest <laughs> Ferrari in the country, actually. Yeah, let's do it. Well, actually, this one doesn't even run. It's so cheap. When we hung it in a tree, we kind of broke it. Um, Oh, I have an idea. Oh yeah, I'm thinking more like this, the monster truck. And we did get the new Team Roar branding on there after all. It looks like a giant Hot Wheels. You think about driving this? Yes, but I don't like the fact that I'm driving it next to this massive gas tank. Well, we just filled it up with gas so it's ready to drive all day long. We can crush cars, do monster truck stuff. And have you ever driven this anyways? I've driven the Hummer monster truck. I like that because it's like a Hummer. This is an old school thing. Yeah, this is the real deal. Real monster truck, super crazy and raw. Yeah, you know, first things first, you gotta climb up there, Steve. All right, so. I recommend the back tire. Can you grab one, I guess? Mm, kind of. Anything goes, right? You can't grab just about anything. Oh, that see. handle up there, which would be great to grab, it's actually broken. No, oh. yeah, that's, so open the door, perfect. <gasps> now how do you get in? Okay, go all the way up. Okay, thing. so grab the, the pole, and then you gotta split and step to there. Oh, I don't like this thing. Yeah. It's already so high off there the ground. There we go, they gotta do the splits. Don't rip, <laughs> don't rip your pants. I don't like this. Come on, Carter. I'm just gonna do this. Yeah. If I fall right now, it's gonna be so bad. Yeah, you're literally like so high up in the air, you're actually above the, oh, well, above my head, literally. Okay. Okay, you made it. I'm in, I don't. I really don't like this thing though. Okay, great, I'm gonna close the door, I'm gonna hop up and we're gonna get ripped into the monster truck. Ew, there's that big spider on here. No, don't feel yuck. Carter's no! not, Steve, I mean Carter, Carter is not scared of spiders. This spider's disgusting, this one's gonna bite me. Ew! Oh my gosh, Steven's freaking out. We can't even get the vlog done. You ready to drive this thing? Yeah, let's do it. All right, so first things first, turn that. So, this way? Yeah, like then, this? yep. Okay, pump the gas a couple times. It's like stock. No, it's just a gas pedal. Okay. <sighs> I don't okay. like old. Okay. Okay, so now you're gonna turn the key, crank it. Uh huh. There we go. Okay, you get to, it's kind of like the Jeep. What was that? Oh my gosh, it got stuck. It did? Yes. Maybe this thing will catch fire. All right, what do I do? Okay, we gotta get it started so we can get it out of here. Okay. At least I got it back off the position. Yeah, okay, so we're getting closer. So now what do I do? <laughs> this thing is an old monster truck, so there are definitely some quirks and features, but you know, Carter likes that kind of stuff, so let's keep going. Now I need to keep an eye on Carter so I can be one step ahead, because I only have, once he enters, I only have like two to three seconds to get that saran wrap up. Uh, and now I'm gonna text Steven that I'm ready for them to come inside, but I don't know where they went. There we go. And you're off and driving a monster truck. What do I do? Uh, whatever you want, you're in a monster oh! truck, Steve. I can't see anything. Oh, two carters off in a monster truck. This I literally great. can't see anything. Yeah, you, the visibility's not great because it's a monster truck. Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's take a turn. Now we can work our way out to the field. I can't tell yeah. if I'm turning. It doesn't turn very well. Uh, because it's a monster truck. Oh my gosh, you drive this thing on a daily? Yeah, I hope you're, oh, you're kind of off the road. I can't see anything. Okay, so you're gonna try to go that way? Yeah. Oh wait, stop. Oh my gosh, you almost hit the house. I knew I was too close. Dude, something's not right. Okay. Now see if you can turn right. Oh, you're not full turn left, are you? It's all the way. Okay, now forward. 
So the rear steer is not straight. Oh, shoot, it's like totally crooked. Yeah. Steve, you're actually doing great. We're almost to the field. My bad. Oh. Hang tight. My bad. Oops. I didn't see that tree. My bad. It's okay. It's a monster truck. It's it's not easy to drive without that rear steer working. Oh, that's so tight. Oh my goodness. Okay. That was a tight squeeze. And then we have one more tight squeeze up here. And then we're going to be good to go. Turn right, turn right, turn right. And we're here. Now we're home free and you can rip around anywhere you want in the backyard. Woo! Yeah! There we go. I don't just have a monster truck just to have one. I use it to drive and to do monster truck stuff like crush cars. So next up, you got to crush a car. All right, let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Here we go. I can't even see the car. This is our view. It's, you can't see. So Steven is doing a great job. Oh, you're on it. Shoot, I don't want to do it anymore. No, we got to do it. Guys, Steven's actually so scared. Come on, Steve. Oh! 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 <laughs> what did we hit? What was that? That was a car. You ran over a car. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. That was great. Oh, that was crazy. Oh! Mission accomplished. Yeah, you just drove a monster truck and crushed a car. Please, please, please get me out of here. Oh my goodness. That was crazy, I just crushed that car. Oh! Hey Steve, got me in a car, wait for me. Oh my gosh, this is higher than I remember. That was awesome. You looked just like Carter crushing that car, but we are on to the next activity that I normally do in a day. I don't want to know what's next. That was so scary. It's only going to get even crazier from here on out. Let's go. All right, what's the next challenge? Oh, um, I was just coming in for a quick snack. Snack time? Yeah, I, you know, I got to eat. I'm human. Well, then we got to take the snowmobile and go across the water. Go, 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 go. Yeah, well, last but not least, of course, you are going to be driving the snowmobile. And honestly, you're probably going to sleep. I think this is going to be a failed challenge, but we do have snacks all lined up, ready to go. Great. Yeah, grab uh, sometimes Skittles. Mr. B sends me chocolate and I eat some of that. But uh, I'm honestly pretty thirsty. Okay, we'll hydrate up. <laughs> what? Car two right now. Yes. I'm going to snowmobile across the lake. We'll see how that goes. I'll go almond. <laughs> Mr. Beast almond chocolate. Okay, perfect. We should do it out of his bedroom. Hold on, hold on. Okay, Carter's going to the bathroom right now. Now's our chance. Steven, um, <laughs> you forgot I'm a YouTuber. I don't fall for friends. Oh! 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 <laughs> <laughs> That's actually so funny. I had no idea what you guys were trying. And here's the hidden camera too. Carter, I mean, Steven, Carter, you so, you can't, Carter can't bring Carter, come on. We almost got you. Yeah, almost. Next up, Carter 2.0 is, well, the snowmobile. This isn't the challenge. This is just the boat we need to take to get to the other side of the lake for the next challenge. Oh, somebody parked it way up on the grass. Look at this, it's way out. Carter, I'm gonna need your help. Okay, let's push this thing in. I mean, we could just go front ways even, that's even better. There we go. There we go. Oh, there she goes. Okay, stop. Oops. Okay, and uh, we're taking the jet boat over to the snowmobile. She's not made to go on water, but, but apparently that's Carter's next challenge. And so far I've crushed every single challenge, even crushing the monster truck. Oh! <laughs> so I'm feeling confident about this, but we'll see what happens. There's a high chance he's just gonna fall in and sink. Last challenge for the day, Steve, is to ride the snowmobile, which sinks across the water. Sounds impossible, but if you go fast enough, it will stay afloat. And if I make it all the way across, I'll be giving away one free VIP meet and greet ticket. I'm really rude. So yeah, if I don't make it though, we'll see what happens. But I do want to remind you though, this is, um, well, I've sunk it many times. In my first try, I sunk. <laughs> I've accomplished every other challenge so far, so let's just let's just go for it. I mean, you crushed a car in a monster truck, so I feel like you could do this. You want a VIP meet and greet ticket? Comment down below. Share, fam. I want to see how many people want this ticket. Athletic stance, and then probably start there and line it up. So I'm just going to do a whole dry run and just show you. All right, here's the dry run. Okay, this is a dry run. Just show me how to do it. For the meet and greet ticket. Dry run in three, two, one. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh! That was.
was almost a wet run. Steve, you ready? This is your time to shine. I'm doing it for the VIP meet and greet tickets. You're scared though, huh? Oh yeah, I mean, it's scared. You're driving a thing that's not made for the water across the water. Yeah, and you have no test runs over shallow water. It's straight over the deep part. With the Smash wig still on? <laughs> Looks good, you look literally just like me. So do a little test rip in the grass. This is, um, it's rather intimidating and to not practice like I did when I did in my video across the shallow part. You got to go a little faster than that. I think I'm just gonna try it, whatever. Guys, you gotta smash that like button right now for my brother Steven who's acting like me for the whole day because this is some serious stuff. This is scary. really interesting if you can actually snowmobile on water. It is kind of like jet skiing, but it's also so different. He loves jet skis, but this is wild. I don't know if this is it. I think this might be it. Here we go. I think this is it. Go, 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 <laughs> oh my goodness! I did it! Woo! I can't believe it! Oh my gosh! I literally can't believe it. He actually did. It looked like he was going slow the whole time. I did it. That, that was, was insane. Crazy. You kind of went like too slow, but it kept going. Yeah, because once I got on the water, I was like, go, go, go! And then you jumped and ripped up the hill. Well, I guess you can officially return back to Steven now. Da, 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 da. I can't believe someone's getting a free VIP pass to your show. All right, comment down below, Share Fam, if you want this free VIP ticket. I made it across the water. I'm giving this away. <laughs> By the way, these are the list of cities I'm going to, so make sure you get your tickets right now at stevenshare.com. Hit the subscribe button, Gary, for more awesome videos coming your way. Until next time, you know what to do. Stay awesome and share the love. Peace. Woo!